hi viewers thank you for joining me again in another episode of weekly dose of african aviation on my channel aviation info as we all know aviation info is your favorite youtube channel where i was bring to you latest updates with what is happening in the african aviation sector in these are episodes titled weekly dose of african aviation we bring you updates to what is happening all through the african aviation sector this include new airlines that are coming in this include new purchases of aircrafts this include new routes and any other updates meanwhile did you miss our last episode of weekly dose of african aviation kindly click on the link to watch what happened previously in the african aviation sector And going on our headlines, we will bring you information from Esther Tini Air. We will talk about Cameroon Airline Corporation. We will talk about Kenya Airways. Equally, we will talk about TAG Angola. We will bring you information from Nigerians Airpiece. We will talk about Ugandan Airlines. And also, we will talk about Royal Air Maroc Fly Angola. And lastly, on our list, we will talk about Zambia Air. Are you still new on my channel and you like this kind of content be sure to subscribe and turn on notifications so you will notify first when i upload content tag angola now offers two daily flights to portugal since the reopening of the air borders tag angola airlines has been performing very well on its route to lisbon portugal the company intends to make a lasting impact on this key market for its operation Nigerian Airpiece will now arrive in Israel next month. Airpiece has been planning a direct regular flight to Israel for several years, having served it on a special flight for the first time during the pandemic. Nigerian largest airline sees it as an important market niche for its religious tourism. Founded in 2013, with its head office in Ekija, Lagos State, Nigeria, Airpiece is the largest airline in Nigeria, operating up to 20 destinations with a fleet size of 13 aircrafts. And moving to East Africa, Uganda Airlines obtained traffic rights to serve Rwanda. Rwanda and Uganda intend to further boost their bilateral relations. On the occasion of the 11th session of the Standing Joint Commission, the two neighboring countries reviewed several existing agreements and took a number of decisions, particularly in the air transport sector. Ugandan Airline is a national carrier of Uganda. The company is a revival of the older Uganda Airlines which operated from 1977 up to 2001. The current carrier began flying in August 2019 and currently operates a fleet size of 6 aircraft with 12 destinations. And going to Central Africa, Cameco Cameroon Airlines Corporation will resume flights to Bangui in Central Africa after three years of suspension. At the peak of its operation, Cameco served nearly all the Central African capitals and four routes in West Africa. In 2019, it had been forced to focus on the domestic market as it faced operational and management challenges. The situation is a tumor to the Cameroon national career as it is gradually rebuilding back its regional network. Erling enters Nairobi and breaks Kenya Airways monopoly over South Africa. Erling, the biggest company in South Africa, serves more than 45 destinations in 13 countries. Based on a fleet size of nearly 60 Embraer aircraft, the South African private carrier continues to expand its East African continental route, venturing into the dynamic Kenya market for the first time. Zambia Airways launches first ever regional route connecting Harare. Zambia Airways commenced operations in December 2021. 
One year later, the joint venture between the Zambia State and Ethiopian Airlines is conquering the regional market with the aim of connecting most South Africa countries. Royal Air Maroc will now return to Russia in May after more than a year of absence. Against its will and because of the Russian-Ukrainian war, Royal Air Maroc suspended flights to Russia in March 2022. After more than a year of absence, the Moroccan national carrier has decided to return to the country as conflict with its neighbors still continues. Fly Angola creates a branch in Central African Republic to serve Central Africa. The Central African Republic currently have no private or public airline. To fix this, the landlocked country of Central Africa, served mainly by foreign operators, has launched a bid for the establishment of a local operator. The business plan proposed by Fly Angola has attracted the authorities in Bangui. And the last but not the least on our list, it's a new airline coming in the African sector, Esther 20 Air. Successfully launch of Esther 20 Air with its fleet of Embryo aircrafts. Esther 20's new national carrier officially commenced flight operations on Sunday, March 26, 2023, with the opening of its first route to Johannesburg. And this has been the updates we brought to you in this week's episode of Weekly Dose of African Aviation. Let us know your thoughts in the comment section. And are you still new to Aviation Info? Please don't forget to subscribe so you never miss up any of my updates. Thank you.